Hello everyone, this is Paul from OrthoEvalPal and today we're going to talk about upper extremity myotomal testing. So um, it's important that when we do our neurological exam with the patient, not only do we do reflex testing, sensation testing, but we do test muscle strength of the upper extremity that can really help us determine what level uh, is most affected. And so uh, I'd like to thank Dave here for helping me out. Dave is my videographer, photographer, he edits everything and um, he's a, a great subject. So when we start from the top down, we start with C1, C2, okay, so we resist flexion. So I want you to hold here, don't let me push you back. Don't let me push you forward. Good, all right, C3 is side to side, so resist me, don't let me push. Don't let me pull, great, C4 are going to be the upper traps. I want you to shrug your shoulders up towards your ears. Resist. Rarely do I ever have a problem with C4, but I have had patients who have had injuries, and uh, it's very rare, but uh, it does occur. Um, C5, deltoids. I want you to hold right there. Don't let me push down. And when I test C5, I also test supination, so don't let me turn your palms inward. So resist me, resist me, resist me. Good. And then I also test the biceps. Um, because there is, go ahead and hold, there's also um, some C5 in the biceps also. So I always do supination, buys, and abduction. Okay, C6, I like to do wrist extension, so hold right here. Do not let me push your hand down. Good. And then C7, triceps, don't let me push up. Hold, 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 hold. Good. C8 is finger flexion, or to do a quick exam, I do um, the OK sign. So we're going to bring the index finger and thumb together. Hold it there. Don't let me open it. Now, don't mistake in this one with C6, because if you have C6 weakness and you can't hold that wrist in a nice position, um, then you lose that active uh, insufficiency. All right. So you want to make sure that they have good wrist extension while you're testing the C8. Otherwise, the C8 will look like it's giving. Your finger flexors will be weak if you're in this position rather than this position. All right. And then T1, finger abduction. Don't let me squeeze the fingers together. Great. And that's our upper extremity myotome testing from C1 through T1. If you have any questions, please contact me at paul at orthoevalpal.com. If you want to see um, a certain video, make sure you put it into the comments below. And I hope you like our videos. Please uh, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and um, stay tuned because I have lots more videos for you to come.